Hi all, welcome once again to Kessler's Photography Photoshop Tutorials. Today I'll be giving a little tutorial of a technique that I use for quite a long time now. And um, I use it on quite a lot of my pictures as well. So ap apparently this style of technique that I will show you is frequently used now in uh, high fashion and editorial magazines. So let's stop rambling and get on with my favorite Photoshop technique. By all means, this is not my invention, and I have gathered all my knowledge over the years on the internet myself. This is just a way to show you how I do it in my own way. So, we will be working with two pictures now. One is uh, just a general portrait, and the other one is a portrait of Muhammad Ali. Just to show you on different pictures what the style does. We will start with the portrait. What I do now is duplicate the layer twice. I can do that by pressing Ctrl J or just dragging it over to the new layer icon like this. I click on the middle layer and I put an adjustment layer on it in black and white. I click off the top layer so we can see the black and white picture now and we go between the modes or you can adjust the black and white like you want yourself. For example, for this picture I will be using the green filter because I find the eyes coming out a little bit better on the black and white. Ok, we have done that. Now we click again on the top layer and we click it on again so we can see the picture again. Now we are going to change from the top layer the blending mode to overlay. And this is basically it already. This is the technique. It shows what it was before. By pressing Alt, I click on the little eye before the background here, and on again, off, and on again. You can see what a difference this makes in, in, in your picture. It's very high fashion, very nice. I will do the same now with a picture of Mohamed Ali. I will center it a little bit more like this. And now I will be pressing Ctrl J twice again, like this. I take the middle layer and an adjustment layer in black and white. I click off the top layer so we can see the black and white again. And we change the mode again. Here I'm going to use the green filter because I like that one the best. But you can fiddle around with it and make it how you like it the most. But here I use the green filter. Again I click back on the top layer and I show it again and I change the blending mode to overlay. Here you see the picture finished. This was before and this is after. You see quite a big difference in, in, in the picture style now. And what you can change as well, what has been used quite a lot as well, is changing now the opacity down to 60%, 50% depending what you like and you have the desaturated look that has been used quite a lot as well and you see that's after that's before a much more striking picture especially with uh, a person with, with a lot of muscles and, and things like that it, it shows much more power than the original picture does well that was basically it I hope you enjoyed the very fast and little tutorial I just made if you want to see more of my tutorials, just check out my blog and uh, I hope you enjoyed it. Take care. Bye.